So first place woman, Brandy, uh, how do you pronounce Air her? Airholz. How did it go for you today? You know, I'm pleased. This is only my second ultra and I just had this little guy um, six months ago. So really this was just something on the calendar to get myself back in shape. Um, my big goals are still this summer for the trying for the mountain yeah. team. So today was just about getting a good long hard effort in um, and trying to remember to fuel because I'm not very good about doing that and it was beautiful. I, I'm not complaining. Now, coming from uh, the U.S. mountain running team, you're used to shorter distances. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I think I'm still working on learning how to pace, but it's like, I have a hard time not starting off super fast. Just because I'm used to running at 10K, or a half marathon 10 mile, but it's fair that I run more than two or three hours. So definitely I have a little bit to run to get on the fueling and overall pacing, and even the technical downhill stuff, even in mountain running, that's kind of my weakness. So this was good practice. For that, and then the trails here are a lot different than what I run on in Colorado. They're a lot more wet and technical and muddy, but sure. it was beautiful. It was one of the most pretty courses. And well, like running past the waterfalls and getting splashed on was awesome. Awesome. Yeah, it well, was beautiful. Great. They put on a great race, and I'm just happy to be here. And the rain made it a little more fun as well. Yeah, something you're not used to in Colorado. Yeah, no, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> we could use the little rain in Colorado. Well, great. Thank you, and uh, good luck in your summer plans. Thank you.